Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. You are welcome to the City Bible for Schools e-learning program. This is the financial accounting for senior secondary school two for the third week of the third term of this uh, academic session. We are still on the solution of partnership. Having earlier discussed about the solution of partnership, where the profit was made by the partners, where the profit, the loss was made by the partners, where a partner brought in cash to settle his uh, efficiency. Today we are going to be looking at the solution of partners partnership, where partners taking take over assets and liabilities on the solution. So that is the area we are going to be looking at today. Partners taking over of assets and liabilities on uh, the solution. To illustrate that, let's have an illustration. Said, Bashir, and Otman are into retail business, sharing profits or loss equally. They agreed to dissolve the business and the balance sheet as of 31st December 2017 stood as follows. Choose for this as follows. Said Bashir and Otman are into retail business, sharing profit or loss equally. They agreed to dissolve the business. The balance sheet as of 31st December 2017 is this. Balance sheet. We have the capital, the capital of Said was 20,000 per share, 10,000 Otman, 6,000 Naira. The capital total is 6,000 Naira. We have the current account of Saeed, 6,000 per share, 4,000 and Otman, 2,000. Totaling 12,000 Naira. And the creditors worth of 7,000 Naira. Then we have the assets. Motor car was 5,000 Naira. Building was 10,000 Naira. Investment was 25,000 Naira. White stock, 6,000 Naira, Goodwill, 6,000 Naira, the cash was uh, 3,000 Naira. Then we have the balance of 55,000 on both side of the balance sheet. The partners agreed that the partnership should be dissolved based on the following terms. So this is the agreement to the, uh, uh, for dissolving the business. When motor car to be taken over by Said at a value of three thousand naira, and the order to be taken by Otman at four thousand naira. So one motor car is to be taken by Said for three thousand naira, and the other motor car was to be taken by Otman for four thousand. Naira. The investment we are all sold for 7,000 Naira. The creditors we are settled in full. Goodwill was realized as uh, 3,000 Naira, while the cost of the solution was uh, 1,000 Naira and uh, was paid. You are required to prepare relation accounts, partners' capital accounts, as well as the cash book. So that's the question. Uh, the partners take over some of the assets of the business. Uh, Saeed take, take, took uh, one motor car while uh, Utman take another the second motor car. The creditors were settled in full. That, therefore, there will be no discount of creditors. Then the uh, cost of the solution was 1,000 naira and it was paid. Then goodwill realized three thousand naira, and investment we are sold for seven thousand naira. And the question now requires us to prepare realization accounts, the partners' capital accounts, as well as the cash book. Now to the solution. This is how to solve the question. Realization account. Realization account. Uh, it follows the principle of double entry, where we have the book value of the assets debited 
are the amount realized credited. So the book value of the assets, we have motor car, which was valued at 5,000 Naira, investment 25,000 Naira, building 10,000 Naira, stock 6,000 Naira, and goodwill, which was valued at uh, 6,000 Naira. Why the cost of the solution, which is an expenses, was also debited to the relation account, and it was a uh, 1,000 Naira. Amounts realized, amounts realized from the, the from the, the solution of the business, uh, investment realized 7,000 Naira, building realized 20,000 Naira, stock 3,000 Naira was realized on, from stock, Why Goodwill realized the 3,000 Naira. Now, comparing the total of the book value as side to that of the amount realized then the there are properties taken over by the partners as can be seen uh Sai took over a motor car for three thousand naira and uh, Otman took over a motor car for four thousand naira so you had with the amount realized in cash and the one taking over, the total of the amount realized was uh, 40,000 Naira. Was 40,000 Naira. While, while the book value of the asset was uh, 53,000 Naira. And uh, if the, since the amount realized was lesser than the book value of the asset, then the business run to a loss of a 13,000 Naira on, a, on the solution. The business run into the loss of 13,000 Naira on the, so, the solution. Now to the uh, capital account. The capital account of the business. We have Said. Bashir Utman, Said Bashir Utman on both sides. The balance brought forward of the capital of the partners are 20,000 Naira for Said, as they were stated in the question, 10,000 Naira for Bashir, as was stated in the question, Utman 6,000 Naira. Then the current account of the partners are, the balance are 6,000 Naira for Said, Bashir 4,000 Naira, and Utman 2,000 Naira. On the debit side, the share of loss was 433 to Said, to, uh, Said 4,333 to Bashir also, and 4,334 to Hotman because they shared their profit or loss equally. So the loss realized on realization was shared equally. Then you have to take you have to take notice of the motor car taken by the by the partners. Therefore, uh, Said took over a motor fan with the worth of uh, 3,000 Naira, while Otman took over the one with the worth of uh, 4,000 Naira. Now, adding the, the analysis on Said now, adding the capital brought forward of Said, to his current account balance. Bali Said has 26,000 Naira as total amount. Then, we need to deduct his uh, liabilities from the amount realized. And the liabilities are, for Said are, the motor car, which, we, which, he, was, which he, he took over, which was worth uh, 3,000 Naira, and his share of a loss. So by adding the value of the motor car to the to his share of loss, we have seven thousand three hundred thirty-three naira to be deducted from uh, Said balance of twenty-six thousand naira. Therefore, the cash balance to be given to Said will be eighteen thousand six hundred and sixty-seven, as it is shown on in Said on the debit side of the capital account in the Said column. Moving on from Said analysis, 
now let's look at how uh, the account, the capital account of uh, Bashir was uh, balanced. As we all know, capital brought forward of Bashir was uh, ten thousand naira, and his current account brought forward was uh, four thousand naira. Adding that four thousand naira to ten thousand naira, he has a uh, fourteen thousand naira. And Bashir does not have any liabilities more than the uh, is more than his share of a uh, loss, which was four thousand three hundred and thirty three. Therefore, deducting 4,333 from 14,000 Naira of, of uh, Bashir, uh, the cash balance to be collected by Bashir was uh, 9,667 as, as it is shown on the debit side of the capital account under the Bashir column. Now, to Utman. Utman capital brought forward was 6,000 naira and his current account brought forward was uh, 2,000 naira, totaling 8,000 naira in value. But Bashir took over a motor car. Utman took over a motor car which was worth uh, 4,000 naira and he still has the share of loss of 4,334. By adding his the value of the motor car taking over plus his share of loss, he has the liability of 8,334 naira to settle to be settled. And the total amount in his account was 8,000 naira. So Otman has to bring in the cash of uh, 334 naira for to settle his uh, deficits. So that's why on his uh, capital account, if, if, on, his, on the credit side, he was credited with uh, 334 naira brought in to clear his uh, deficit. So that's how to prepare the capital account. So for Said, he has a total of 26,000 naira on both sides. For Bashir, 14,000 on both sides. And for Otman, 8,334 on both sides. Having done justice to the capital account, we now need to look at the uh, cash account. The cash account. The cash account will tell us the amount realized and how it was spent, how it was uh, disbursed, how it was spent. Now, the debit and credit side of the cash account, we have the balance brought forward of our cash from the balance from the question, which was the which was three thousand naira balance brought forward cash account three thousand naira. Investments realized 7,000 naira. That is, we sold our, all our investment for 7,000 naira. Building was sold for 20,000 naira cash. Stock was sold for 3,000 naira. And uh, 3,000 naira was realized on the good way. So, on that debit side also, we can notice that uh, the amount brought in by Utman to to clear his deficit in the capital account was stated, which was uh, 3, 334 naira, which was 334 naira. Moving to the credit side of the cash account, we have the cost of the solution, that is the amount spent on the solution of the business, which was 1,000 naira. It was paid out of the amount realized. Then, creditor of 7,000 naira was settled. Then, Said collected his. Uh, Capital balance of 18,667 naira and Bashir collected his uh, capital balance of 9,667 naira. So the both sides settled with uh, 36,334 naira on the debit side of the cash account and 36,334 naira on the credit side of the cash account. Now, I've already explained all this cash analysis. This is how cash account was prepared. All the amount that came in, 36,334 naira, that is the cash in the balance sheet brought forward 3,000 naira, cash realized on investment 7,000 naira, cash realized on building 20,000 naira, cash realized on stock 3,000 naira, cash realized on goodwill 3,000 naira, and cash brought by Otman to save his capital account deficit of uh, 334 naira, totaling 36,334. Then we left the credit side from it, cost of dissolution paid, 1,000 naira, credit settled with cash, 7,000 naira, 
cash paid to Said for capital account balance, 18,667. Cash paid to Bashir for capital account balance, 9,667. Then we have the, there will be no balance brought down or balance carry down since the business is, was uh, dissolved. That is the convenient point for us on the, to land of our discussion on the dissolution of a partnership. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.